Quite simply, Pole Position Raceway is the fastest indoor karting in America. It's just a great place to come with your friends and family. Come have some fun and blow off a little steam that we can all use these days. So we, uh, we're we open every day of the year, including Christmas, New Year's, Thanksgiving, you name it. And we see literally hundreds a day come through here. Right now with the restricted capacities, we're limiting it to uh, less guests in-house. So if you come in and it's full, we'll simply book you for a later time, come back when it's your time to race. But we can see hundreds of people every day through here. Yeah, of course, we closed down in March with everybody and we're fortunate to be open up uh, there at the end of May when the governor went to phase two. And so we're doing everything we can to keep our customers safe. Race safety has always been a part of our message here at Pole Position Raceway, but now it's also about health and sanitization. So, of course, we have the obligatory face coverings for all of our employees and guests. We have hand sanitizer pretty much everywhere you walk. We have a, a, a high-tech touchless uh, temperature scanner when you walk in the door. Uh, we've added extra inventory of helmets, and we even have a, a hospital-grade helmet sanitization chamber to UV light sanitize all the helmets in between every single use. The thing about the UV sanitization chamber, uh, it's one thing to spray a surface, right, with a, a, with a, a chemical, but this UV, it goes around 360 degrees. It really does stuff that just normal procedures won't handle. It was a big investment for us, honestly, but I just think there's nothing more personal than that helmet going on your head, and so there's nothing more important for us to make sure it's sanitary for you. It's very different times that we live in, and we lost literally hundreds of thousands of dollars by being closed, and we spent tens of thousands more to get back open. But it was important for us to do the right thing. And it's not about just surviving right now for me. We want to thrive, and we want to make Vegas and show that Vegas is a place that people want to come. Our families and our friends and our, our neighbors here want to know that they're coming into a safe place. And for us, it's always about being resilient and showing that we're always Vegas strong.